And one of the feel-good stories of the year, the emergence of AI. Worked his way through the G League, landed on an NBA roster. Shaq, you get to watch him tonight. First of all, I don't see why he was even in the G League, because mm. only a handful of guys come out the G League every year and stick on the NBA roster. Trust me, this guy's like double-sided tape. He gonna be sticking, Ernie. Oh! oh. I've been sitting on that one for a it's while. A long yes, time. I have. Beat that. Well, I'll tell you what, his, the level of play, though, in the G League has improved every year. Fantastic games. This really prepares you for the NBA. And you know what it's like, Ernie? Uh, no, what is it like? It's like a shoe with no sole. You're gonna feel the ground and stick, baby. Feel the ground and stick. Ernie, you know his real name? What's that? Stick Hill O'Neal. Oh, mm. that's much better than what I said. Yeah. Yeah. That was some weak stuff right there. Here's Kevin Harlan. AI outside. The pass to Simmons. And he drops it in from the low post. Now it's a they looked in that environment, made the most of their possessions. They were extremely efficient, Greg. They ran their offense well and took good high percentage shots. And he's got his first chance at the line here. Free throw, no good for AI. Raptors trail by three. Passes it to Ananope. The shot misses. Chandler with down low. Here's Shaw. Oh! And this sort of awesome dunk is one of the reasons this team is in charge of this game. Well, th there's a swagger out there. You can see it on the court that they possess and are not afraid to show it either. Well, after the Raptors fell short of their goals last season, you knew there were going to be changing some things up. Well, obviously, the first big move was moving on from Dwayne Casey as the head coach. And you think about Dwayne had brought the best years this franchise. And right kicks to Leonard, knocked away. And we'll be back with you shortly. Serge Ibaka talked about his role on this team. I like to do all those little things, running up and down, blocking shot, and straight to the floor, making open shot, you know, rolling the basket, screen, you know, those dirty work. I like to do that. For the fourth member of our crew, Hall of Famer David Aldrin. Well, guys, Kyle Lowry is a player who has worked his way to stardom. He says, I still feel like I can be better. I'm never satisfied. Chandler, the pass to AI. Two points, that one goes. Now it's a sick back to Lowry and stolen by AI. Throws up and AI throws it down. And guys got careless with the ball there and the turnover leads. Commitment. Uh, you have to be willing to hire good talent. You have to be willing to hire coaches that you believe either developmentally are going to have a bright future or if you're hiring ex an experienced coach with championship pedigree, are you willing to pay those types of positions? Uh, what is your... AI kicks to Simmons. The shot's good. Simmons. Here's Embiid again, Philadelphia. You have been playing great the last few games, and that has carried over into this game. How have you had everything clicking? Well, uh, I'm in a perfect spot, you know, in, in terms of where I'm fitting into the framework of the team. And I know exactly what my role is, you know, what I need to provide. And, uh, you know, coaches using me in any way possible, and my teammates have put me in the best position to succeed. And they are reaping the rewards of your great play so far. Guys? All right, David, thank you, and stay with us, folks. We'll be... And here's MB. 11 points in the game. Here's AI. The basket good off the assist from Simmons. 14 points for eight. Here's over Covington. Leonard, no luck. Now that's where they want to go with the ball. They can tolerate a few misses as long as he gets his touches inside. Pass to Simmons. That's another one for him. His fifth in just seven shots. Guys. Green on Covington. And it's Leonard missing. Laps defensively, and they actually get away with it. Bad idea to leave him open consistently, though. Here's AI. Another three for Philadelphia. Uh, a sin. 
And Philadelphia grabs the miss. They host the Clippers after this game. That'll be the first of two straight at home. Redick with the bucket. That's an example of great communication. He knows the spot to get to and the hard shooter. Embiid with a screen on low. Off the pick. And the dunk by Embiid. And he just dangles from the bucket. <laughs> no good from Valanchunas. Philadelphia leading by 12. AI kicks to Redick. AI outside. Embiid sets the pick for AI. And a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. Doris, statistically, today's game is picked apart by so many, so many different ways. But for you, what are the statistics? So it's all of those little defensive stats that you really have to track and be monitoring to understand the value that they have on winning. Very And that's the battle. They haven't been winning today. Their work on the glass has been poor. Under five on the shot clock. It's hauled in by the 76ers. Chandler's got his third rebound tonight. You can see the frustration in the quarter on his face, especially with his team trailer. I'm sorry, that's poor defense down low again. It's been defense right there. You didn't put up enough fight early to keep him from scoring in the post. It's good. Eight points for Dario Scharch. And how about the excellent five rebounds and two assists? And this is the kind of strong, steady play you like to see. He's earning his keep and helping them win games. I think they need more consistency from him, and they're getting it. Look for this to continue. I love it. And the shot goes in. AI's got ten points in just the second half. There's AI outside. Fires from the wing. And the 76ers tack on two more. And it's AI with the rebound. AI's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Well, this is a tough night so far. They'd be smart to rely more on a couple of their other options. Can't connect from short range. Comes in for Johnson. And it's TJ McConnell in for JJ Reddick. Muscala dishes to AI. Buried from 15 feet out. AI's in this one easily. And in the win, a comfortable win in what was, I think, gee, a pretty hostile environment. Congratulations on the win. You were the driving force out there on offense. So why were you so effective? Well, uh, you know, they didn't make it easy on me, DA. Uh, but I was determined to get us all the points that we needed. No matter how they were playing me, uh, I didn't want it. I didn't want to leave it to anyone else tonight. You know, I just wanted to be the one to get us there and, and to get our fans and get everybody this victory. So I'm glad it worked out. Hey, Veronica, how you doing? You were cooking out there last night, Killer. Oh, thank you, thank you. So, uh, what's going on? Mom, just, I'm bearing witness to the rise. <laughs> Look, okay, you can, uh, you can mellow a little bit with the trademarks. It's okay. Look, I, I know you want to fit in, but you don't have to fall behind, okay? The vet's like a leader, and you have to get used to trademarks because both Foot Locker and Gatorade call to talk. About me? No, about your mom. Oh, you got jokes. Okay. Yeah, of course about you. <laughs> They're noticing your story. They're noticing your game. People are starting to look at you, and I am telling you, America loves a comeback. Wow. So, I mean, who's first? You tell me. Where do you want to start? Great. I'll set it up for later this week.